New research don't come out are COVID-19 don't cause autism and higher risk of different types of developmental delays for children where they're born uh, five years ago and four years ago. So according to news, the new, uh, the the country for do the research and the percentage the statistics where they bring come out and children where they have way affect and how it don't affect these innocent children so i will see put the link down below for comment section if you're not doing a research online when i will see see the news online this uh, article they read them from fan page now italian um now italian italian journalist now them post them so my people according to news this one are waiting the right to with covid risk of autism and developmental delays for children born to mothers infected during covid those mama will contest positive to covid 19 when they get their picking belly so this children they get their belly get higher risk of autism or other uh, developmental delays so make we continue as the tea writer more than same analyzing data from over 18,000 children born during the height of the COVID-19 pandemic between 2020 and 2021. U.S. researchers have determined that children of mothers infected with the COVID-19 coronavirus during pregnancy have significantly higher risk of autism, developmental disorder, and developmental delays. Make we continue. They say children born to women who tested positive for the uh, for the pandemic pathology while pregnant, 142 or 16.3 percent were diagnosed with a neurodevelopmental disorder, delay or other issue within the six months of birth. By contrast, among the 17,263 mothers not exposed to the virus during pregnancy, there were. 1680 cases of neurodevelopmental di uh, diagnosis equal to 9.7 percent of the total if we now compare the difference now a big way well, well, to mothers we test positive uh when they get their picking belly during covid and those will be seen then test negative they not contact the virus by comparing the data and accounting for other factors that could influence the risk, the researchers determined that COVID-19 infection during pregnancy increases the risk of neurodevelopmental disorder such as autism by 29%. The chances of diagnosis increase, especially if the infection occurs in the last three months of pregnancy. So the chances increase if uh, the mama contacts this COVID-19, the last three months of pregnancy, we, we mother they call last trimester. So they can't go further explain, you know, bring out the statistics. And they can't go further explain uh, the uh, the month and the year we then specify for these cases. They say School of Medicine reached their conclusion after analyzing data on 18,124 live births to women who gave birth between March 1st, 2020 and May 31st, 2021. So this through this period of time, neither then do not specify say it say affect a lot of children. Normally then bring the thing come out for 2019, but now for China, neither for first see the first case before you can the ones can enter America, can enter European countries. So with their analysis, with their statistics, then talk say they conclude say coronavirus it affect a lot of children where their mama gets their belly. And they can they can test positive, especially the last three months. When they see different kind of things where they happen, our coronavirus don't affect a lot of people. Even some, if now they watch news where where some will take the vaccine, they talk say some because they forget get a kind or different kind of pathology, they forget kind of sickness, they just they buy later they can't diagnose that because of the uh, vaccine where they take. So different kind of things now it's, now it don't cause for people. I mean, a lot of people then sick by, and we still know a lot of picking where they're born. Five years ago, four years ago, during that corona, some of them, majority of them, they get different kind of disability. We just pray by the grace of God, make everything they okay with them. They decide and go therapy, everything will do okay with these innocent children. Thank you and remain blessed.